Hello, Mr. Ollivander. I wondered if you might be able to help me with something. Yes. Professor Fig sent an owl informing me that you'd be coming. He was a bit cryptic. Said you need to have a special wand crafted. That you'd bring me the materials. Yes, sir. I have them here. Oh, my. How extraordinary. Remarkable design. I will be honest, I have never crafted a wand in this fashion. Repaired broken wands, of course, but this is something else entirely. Keeping your mind yeah, just, just fix the fucking I wand, think dude. I can work with what you've brought me. Let me see what I can do. Hmm. Oh yes, wand shaped. <laughs> I like how the wand, something crazy happened in that room. Like, I'll look outside instead. It Nothing to done. see here. I carry around this wand, only this one never thing, seen apparently. One like this before. My suspicion, as Professor Fig implied in his letter, is that it serves a unique purpose. I doubt you shall find much use for it otherwise. I understand. Thank you, sir. I'm afraid you're on your own. I've ensured that we have a moment to ourselves. How did you get uh, the whole town to get? <laughs> no need for such theatrics. In light of what Ranrock now knows, you must agree that our interests are aligned. Our interests. I just want your top hat. Be aligned. You would let goblins take what is rightfully ours. I mean, you were the one helping him for so long. The final repository belongs to wizard kind. Is this really the handle I chose? I thought I had like a wooden one. What's that you've got there? It's a wand for my sweetie. Might this sudden visit to the wand maker have something to do with our mutual pursuit? I have no idea what you're talking about. That repository is my birthright! Charles Rookwood wouldn't have wanted you near it. <laughs> the arrogance. Such insolence! You should know better than to try and reason with a child. I've always said, children should be seen and not heard. Oh, so it wasn't Isadora, or whatever her name was? Morganach? Oh, so this is gonna be one of these things I gotta escape from a fucking place for like. Oh, we're just gonna we're just gonna do battle, huh? That's cool. Oh, they actually found me, huh? Okay. Bonk. Another you guys just like a bunch of poachers. Seriously, this is the best you can do. Get out of here, Mr. Man a mile away. Is it? You guys are like low level guys, you're not even worth my time. Oh, 
You guys are really gonna fight me still? I just like killed a bunch of your dudes. I didn't even take one hit. Am I supposed to hold it or tap it? I'm tapping it. Okay. <laughs> Red is me. Look at that frame rate skip. Ah! Get out of here. Yeah. Oh wait, your magic doesn't work on that, fucko. Oh, ouch. Oh yeah, here you go guys. Here you go. Here's some stuff for you guys. Uh one second too. I have uh I have something more fun. Oh, did your shield work on this? Oh it does, okay. <laughs> Yeah, okay, come on, come on, shoot me, dude. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> oh, circle. Oh, the circle button is hard to tap. I've never done it in a game before. Oh, that feels weird. <laughs> oh, is he dead? Oh, I killed a man. I'm no better than Sebastian. Rookwood's reign is finally over. I'll need to send an owl to Natty right away. What about Harlow? I killed them before I, I killed Harlow. <laughs> chamber and tell Fake what happened. Well, uh, that's another noble wizarding line gone forever. Oh, is Ranrock gonna attack? Cool. Cool! No, fuck. Victor Rookwood is dead. He confronted me as I left Ollivander's with the Keeper's Wand. I had to defend myself. Godric's heart, are you alright? I know you're well able to defend yourself. I've seen it often enough. But Rookwood himself... Yeah, I smoked him. He destroyed so many lives and he wouldn't have stopped. I'm glad I was able to put an end to him. You're right, he wouldn't have stopped. You did what you had to do. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. Thank you for saying so, Professor. I'm ready for what's next. All right, then. The Keepers have been waiting. You have completed all of our trials. Thanks for ending my line. So under circumstances even I did not foresee. You understand now why all of this was necessary. The port key, the vault. The locket, the book, the trials, to ensure that one with the ability you and I share would make the same choice that San, Neve, Charles, and I did. Just manipulating now me. Now that you have witnessed my memory, you understand all that is at stake. Not everyone is what they seem. As you know, light does not exist without shadow, nor shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Even the most well-meaning and competent amongst us cannot possibly know the consequences of manipulating what should be beyond our reach. What lies in the repository must never be released. Resist the temptation to destroy or control it. The magic that you have so carefully honed must now be used only to protect the secret we keep. You have the wand. You will know when to wield it. We leave our legacy in your hands. You gonna blow up your portraits? No? Okay. <laughs> that would've been cool. As if it's magic! Oh, he, oh yeah! Let me just make sure the recording is going okay. Right, no. 
I recorded one whole video without any uh, mic getting picked up. Okay, yeah, it looks like it's going okay. We can only hope that we're not too late and that we find nothing but a repository undisturbed beyond this door. I should hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. Damn the goblins. Damn filthy goblins. Let's go. Oh, do, I, do I not need to do that yet? Okay. I will trust your judgment, dude. If his loyalists are here, he cannot be far behind. It's because you're so loyal to him. Us, Professor. Renbrook will be pleased with our progress. Wow, oh, they really spawned in a lot of guys, huh? Nope, don't, don't spot me! Fuck! Okay, that's not good. Fuck you guys. Don't you fucking try that shit on me, fucko. There you go, how about two of those? Waiting to press on. Ranrock must be here somewhere. This drill stands between us and him. We need to move it. I shall handle it. One moment. Let's go. You idiot! I was gonna sneak up on them. Whoa. Bro, that's not cool. Uh, hold on a second. Here. One. Ow! Okay, that's really annoying. Hold on one sec, dude. Hold on one second. Okay. Yeah, how about that? Don't worry, there's ancient magic there. Is there any chests around here in this last mission, it seems to be? It's a wicked wall. It's a wicked wall. Professor, that wall, that's the way forward. Very perceptive, my young friend. It worked. Let's go. Lumos! Ranrock must be getting closer to finding the repository. I fear you're right, Professor. Why can't I sprint? There's nothing we can do but keep searching. You know, I'm not that worried. If I, if I just run into a fight, I'll run into a fight. Lumos! Listen, more goblins up ahead. I'll take them all. Run the other way. How nice of you. What? All right, guys. I guess I'll kill you all. Okay, there's a lot of barrels here for me to throw at you guys. Not really. I guess those are just, those are uh, important arrows. There, take that, and then I'll. Oh, I can't cut you yet. Okay. You, uh, come down here. Oh. 
Getting closer, Professor. That way. That seems bad. Well, what about the headmaster? <laughs> the goblins have somehow evaded the castle's defensive charms. Hardly hide. All right, I clearly don't have to do any fighting. <laughs> oh, you guys want to dance? All right. Sec, dude. Take a swing at me. Just the one, huh? Okay, that's not enough. No, oh, think that big. Ooh. Would you? Uh. Oh, what the hell? How come that so funny? Think you're a big man, huh? Oh, how come that didn't show up on my thing? I never learned to expel so in this show in this game, huh? No, that was a load bearing column. If I move that faster, huh? That guy's hot in my ass. Fight two of you now. The one quickly. Oh, 
Oh, I thought I was actually gonna have to fight. Can't you guys help me fight Ranrock instead of just doing this? Maybe we shouldn't leave that door this open. Is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. What Isadora showed you. You are now the keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking. What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I plan to keep it secret for now. But in time, when I am ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. That was a strange transition. The arrogance of wizard kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container. All of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. She's supposed to use a red spell, you fool. She didn't know when to give up either. Right, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Oh, there goes Fig. <laughs> he's uh he's super dead. Are we fighting or what's going on here? Shit, I'm not even paying attention to this. Oh, oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, so he mixes it up. That's that's interesting. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, fuck off. 
<laughs> it's so weird. Sometimes it's, it's still backable, sometimes it's pluggable. Like that one, oh my god. Okay, well, at least I have like a million potions. Okay, that was not one of those. Okay, like that. Well, you made me use a whole two potions so far, dude. You're doing pretty good compared to everyone else in this game. I'm not close enough? I'm supposed to keep going forward and that's why. <laughs> Okay, hit him now. Ouch. I, uh, I probably could have been hitting him that whole time, <laughs> the first one. Down? Yeah. All right. You can't run forever, Randrock. Give up now, and I might ensure that your death is swift. There's nowhere to hide now, Randrock. Oh, I should have. I thought I could catch that one. Hi, Caramba. Oh, oh, oh. Shit. Shit. Ooh. Alright. Get him. Get him. Ow. Ow. Okay, <laughs> uh... What just hit me there? Okay, uh, 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 uh. Okay, uh, hold on a second. Hold oh, what the? I said, hold on a second so I can do this. Ouch. Ooh. I didn't care much for him. Huh? 
No, Ranrock, I didn't mean to kill you. You were brothers. Unlike you and your real brother, Loglark. Still alive! Oh yeah! I uh, I saved I saved us all. <coughs> professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you. Certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge. He built a reputation he didn't say renown. Charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. <clears throat> Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig. Well, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can by wisely, resourcefully 
justly and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig! Never imagined we'd attend nice. a funeral for one of our professors. <sighs> Glad Weasley. I mean, they're all pretty old. She honored him. He'll be well remembered. I only wish we could have done the same for Solomon Sallow. I need to go and see Anne soon. Ominous. There's something I need to tell you. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if you faced quite a fight. The rumor's true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait, what are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Victor Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. Oh He's gonna overhear us. This can't be. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. You see, since Feldcroft was of interest to Ranrock, it became of interest Same guys to Rookwood as well. Pathing in here. That's why Rookwood was there the dum night Anne dum. was cursed. I'm marching about. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw Anne, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her. Oh, so cruel. Rookwood got what he deserved. Thank you for telling me. Anne and Sebastian deserve to know, and it should come yeah, from me. Sebastian's probably an ask man right now. I spoke with Black. Sebastian's with the headmaster now, but perhaps there's a way to get word to him. When I find out, I'll send an owl. Oh, I guess the game's not over yet. <laughs> I guess there's still the, the house cup stuff I have to do, right? my mail since uh clear must have a bunch of new ones right oh, i got one new one harlow dude i killed rookwood he's he's dead he, he's a he's a smear on the floor Can you cure from that, really? Just trash. Inventory's almost full, though. No, not really. So I have a huge amount because of all the Merlin trials I did. All right. All right. Let's go talk to Poppy. Travel broadens the mind. Just the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the smidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the centaurs. And I wanted to thank you. When the poachers ambushed us, I... It was nice not to face them alone. I, mean, I did all of the work. Course. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's already been my best year. I wouldn't want to repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. Had you never been to the Three Broomsticks? I used to spend most of my time with Highwing. And, well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Nothing wrong with that. Highwing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal of, uh, human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. 
and share high wing. Yeah, I mean, I kind of have I don't him locked up <laughs> in, in my uh, room I'm requirement. Fine with that. Does your grand know that we found the Snidgets? I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers. But she confessed that she was rather envious about the Snidgets. It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. Pretty sure and I murdered all of them. As allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. That's taking advantage of you and I should them helping us. Soon. Perhaps Highwing can join us? No, I'm too busy farming him for, for feathers. Yeah, beast friends. Hey, I leveled up. I really should really have done that a long time ago, huh? Okay. I think Professor on this card. Let's see. Okay, let's do that next. That's, I know that's a, that's a complete one. How inconvenient travel was before I invented Thank you for coming. Ominous, I received your owl. What's happened with Sebastian? He's been expelled, and will soon face trial at the Ministry. Although Anne wanted to turn him in, I think now she's torn. I confess I know how she feels. As much as we all wanted Sebastian to face the consequences of his actions... I mean, if we didn't turn him in, he'd just keep killing. It will never be the same without him. Just standing here in the Undercroft without Sebastian feels wrong. I never thought things would end this way. I hope we did the right thing. I hope so too. Were you able to tell Sebastian about Rookwood cursing Anne? I was. Black let me talk to Sebastian before he left. At first he wouldn't believe it. Then he realized it all made sense. Unfortunately, his anger only grew towards goblins and dark wizards. Anne was shocked too, but in some sense relieved to know the truth about who was responsible. I think it brought her some peace. I'm glad to hear it. She deserves peace. <laughs> she does. Sebastian was my best friend. I can't imagine Hogwarts or anywhere without him. I know you two had grown close, that you were helping each other with more than just finding a cure for Anne. He never gave specifics, but I know it was important. He meant means a lot to us both. I hope we get the chance to tell him that one day. I know we had a bit of a rocky start, but you've proven yourself as a friend. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. Yeah. Does this lady come up? No? Okay, I'm just think. Alright, let's finish the natty thing off. I got another quest. Let's do this one first. Cause I'm pretty sure she's gonna be like, you gotta do all this extra puzzle shit. Uh, uh wow, you're far away. You fucking. Okay. Let's kill Harlow before he fills the power vacuum, I guess. Not sure by how fucking. A little place like this. What's his face? His exploded body. Alright, you know, I'm just gonna save it for when I get to. What's, what's her face? Penny? Penny, that's the name of my elf. Are you ready to finish Harlow? Uh, hold on, do I have any? I don't have any more Bennett Miss Tentaculas. I hope that's a Mandrix though. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? 
I received an owl from Mrs. Sneak into his house and cut his throat. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested we could gather evidence. Evidence, evidence, evidence. Let's just kill she the dude. Us to stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Precisely. Harlow knows that we saved Archie, and that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. How oh, good. intends to ambush us? But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Harlow, and he knows it. That's why he's resorting to this sort of trickery. We must go. Agreed. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Harlow's reign ends today. Perhaps we ought to inform Officer Singer of our plans. I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Right, well, clearly. Are you concerned she might tell your mother? Oops. Indeed she will. Oops. But so be it. I am tired of from her. My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. I shall pursue them until they are finished. And uh. I think she knows that. As do you. That Sounds like in. you're cruising for a bruising here. Why is it telling me to go somewhere else? Hallow is likely around here somewhere. I sense he is close. Hush, Where is he? I do not know. We should look around. Gallible children walk right into our trap. Ashwinders, we were right. Don't need to shout. They're oh, oh, hilariously decided to spread out. Uh. Show yourself. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, good, 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 good. good. Uh. You will get what is coming to you. Uh. Hey, baby. No more happy days for you. Annoying little kids. You'll get what's coming to you. That was a weird path that guy took. Too late. Nope, I'm looking at the Fuck you, game! Yeah, fuck off. Oh, was that infer you're, you're, you're calling up? You are uh, probably not worth my time. in it and her excruciatingly loyal companion she's loyal to me because I'm I'm a hero you two have done quite a bit of damage to my business interests we killed your boss <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit what was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic fortunately I pride myself on my problem-solving skills hmm Dog, I, I killed like the guy you reported to. I, I'm not too worried about you. Oh man, you almost got me. Fuck you, dude. Okay, you can cast twice in a row. That doesn't seem fair. Oh, shit. Okay. Would you stop wasting my things, dude? You have bros with you, you fucking guy? I thought you were. Fuck you. Yeah, oh wait, I have magic, super magic. Dude. Which button is it gonna be triangle?
Fat lot of help you were, Natty. I mean, you could just, you could just shot him or something. <laughs> That's just fine. It's just excruciating pain. Yeah, see, she's fine. She's just in a wheelchair. Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Yes, mother. I feel fine, and it will do me good to see my friend. Very well. But do not overdo it, Natsai. I know, mother. Ferdinand looks absolutely miserable in Hogshead. <laughs> It is good to see you, my friend. I'm glad to see you're doing so well. I am doing better than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. I mean, I got I crucial. Sure I got right up. Told me that you were all right. <laughs> only because of you. How are you feeling? I would have well, been fine. I'd be days, in intense but pain. But Blaney says that I am on the mend. I'm sorry, Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. It's her fault. What? No. <laughs> She's the one who took us there. Do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... You did what came naturally. I suppose it was instinct. Yes. I could not simply stand there and let you get hurt. Then I shouldn't feel guilty. Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh my. I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. He made a choice based on instinct. My father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind of you to say. I hope that you are right. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? A battle here at Hogwarts everything we have done to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. But we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Harlow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. A few of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. Everything is safer now because of us. Because of you. Thank you, but we make a formidable team. You, my yeah, only I'm like LeBron and you're Patrick Beverly. At Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Thank you for coming to visit me. I did it. It's always good to see you. All right, let me check the recording. Make sure it's fine because uh, before I save over a save slot. Yeah, it looks like everything's recording fine. I never really know, but you know what? It's okay. Let's talk to this uh, Weasley lady. Actually, you know what? Let's go. Okay, let's do that. On. Uh, let's go to the room requirement. Really make more of these benches to make more of these venomous tentaculas. But uh, I mean, at this point, it doesn't matter. Dick thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. Felix potions. Oh, aim at this thing clearly here. Improvements here. 
here is she? Okay, I'm gonna go here. <laughs> So you know, like a faster way. Nope, I clearly went the wrong way. Probably should have went through the hall, but whatever. Cause it's my United States of whatever. What the fuck pathing is this? Professor Weasley, you wanted to see me? I did. We haven't had a chance to speak since... I know you were quite close with Professor Fig. Hogwarts won't be the same without him. No, it won't. But I can assure you that he would want us to press on. And that he would rest easy knowing that the future of the wizarding world is in hands like I know that too. He said that Thank to me you, before he died. Professor. It was like his last words. Quite a year, both inside and outside of Hogwarts. I've heard all sorts of rumors. You've ridden a rap horn, befriended a goblin, rescued hippogriffs, and I don't even want to know the truth behind the rumors that you visited Azkaban. Yeah, crazy lady slashed my companion across the throat with a poison nail. Suspect. I'm just glad you found such a good friend in Miss Sweeting. It's nice to see her engaging more with her classmates. There have evidently been snidget sightings in the area lately. If the centaurs are to be believed, two Hogwarts students are behind it. Uh, I'm certain I don't yeah, know. It was what. ominous. No and the what I would nerd like to from Ravenclaw. Is your wizard's <laughs> field guide? May I see it? Of course. What do you think, Professor? I think you've been busy this year. I see some progress here, but quite a bit of your field guide has yet to be completed. Fortunately, you do have some time to prepare for your OWLs. I will confess, I had a sense about you from that first moment you came bursting in late to the sorting ceremony. I am pleased to see that my instincts were correct. To think you've only been with us a year and you'll already be taking your OWLs, well, it's nothing short of astonishing. I've also killed Thank thousands. You, for everything. You are most welcome. I look forward to seeing what you do during the rest of your time with us. So I just gotta complete my wizard guide, that's it. Let's see. What do I have? I have one more side quest to do. Uh gotta kill some dug bogs. Gotta kill some infamous foes. Four more infamous foes. Gotta kill a bunch of trolls. Okay. Alright, let me see. Uh let me save it here. Resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased.
still something here? Oh wow. I have three of those in my stables. That's what you made it look. Make your. I mean, aren't you supposed to make it look like something that you you think is funny? Exemplify the bravery of Godric Gryffindor. Yeah. And now to finish the loyalty Woo. of Helga Hufflepuff. That's us. Who's who's this guy? Of Rowena Ravenclaw. Hey. And the ambition of Salazar Slytherin. This <laughs> can't supply the winner of this year's house. Excuse me, Headmaster, if I may. One particular student's heroism during the attack on Hogwarts, not to mention the level to which they have excelled in their coursework as a new student, no less. Who's that guy? The guy well, who saved it us all. That it certainly merits. Oh, I'd say. One hundred points to their house. Why are they cheering? They're slithering. They'd be mad. Yes. She doesn't need his permission. She teaches him whatever she wants. Oh no! I suppose we have our winner. Oh, no. oh, did Hufflepuff win? First time in centuries Hufflepuff has ever won. <laughs> Hufflepuff, baby! There's only five, six of us! <laughs> Hufflepuff forever! What a carry job by me!